Good morning, happy Wednesday. Another absolutely spectacular morning. Um, <clears throat> some conditioning this morning, running, sled push, lunges. Um, it was fairly brutal, but made it through and feel really good about it now. It's Wednesday. You have until January 8th at 11.59 p.m. to get your day one photos in, in the first form app, to be entered in the 2024 New Year First Form Transformation Challenge. So I'm gonna put a link in my story again for the app, download the app, take your day one photos, and we can even team up and hold each other accountable. Or you can team up with another buddy and hold them accountable. And you can both win money as a team. So <clears throat> again, download the app, get your day one photos in and get entered in this challenge. It's a spectacular way to change your life in every area. And as we continue on into day three of 2024, <sighs> nothing really changes that it's 2024. Like, yeah, it's a little freaky because it's the beginning of a year and you don't know what's going to happen. You don't know if it's going to be a good year. You don't know what goals to make. You don't know. Um, I mean, you might know some things but there's plenty that you don't know so there's a lot of fear that comes up and there's a lot of anxiety <clears throat> at least in myself but one thing that i think we all need to focus on more is what are we giving in any area what are we giving <clears throat> what are we giving in order to get the things that we need right what are we giving in our relationships? What are we giving in our careers? What are we giving financially? What are we giving? We need to focus more on giving. We all wanna receive and we all think a lot about receiving things or buying things or having things. But how often do we focus on giving things? Whether that's gifts, time, money, anything knowledge, wisdom. What are we giving every day in order to get the things we need, get the things we want? <clears throat> what are we giving? I love you guys. And I hope you have a fantastic Wednesday. I'm what? You're purple? I'm what? I'm purple. What are you? What color are you? Oh, you're a mixture. What? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Watch this, guys. No, we're not watching. I think. Mom, what's your age? If that girl I'm 36. Was five, she had. She had. 36. She had children when she was 10. Okay, so. She is mom's age. Okay, so 36. Um, 36. Right. You mad at me? <laughs> Don't ever. You mad at me? <laughs> Good morning, happy Thursday. Uh, just finished my three mile run for the day. <clears throat> we started off the day with overhead press, um, working up to a heavy set. Um, I was able to get to, uh, let's see, so 45, 50, 95. I don't know, I'll have to do the math and get back to you on that. Anyway, got pretty heavy. Um, okay, it was 155. Three good reps at 155. Um, one rep at 165. Um, 
So not bad, but definitely need to get stronger in that area. Um, oh. Don't think about it too much, guys. There comes a point when you have to not think about it so much and just get it done, All right? Just get it done, and if you make a mess, you clean it up. But there's times when we can't waste time thinking about how it's gonna go or what's gonna happen because then we just trap ourselves. Sometimes we just gotta stop thinking about it and just get it done. <clears throat> I love you guys. Let's have an amazing Thursday. Download the first one map. Get your day one photos in for 11.59 p.m. Central Standard Time on January 8th. Find a teammate, hold each other accountable. You guys could both win a bunch of money. All right? I love you guys. Let's have a great Thursday. All right, day four. Day four of 2024 and day four of 75 hard. I uh, just got done with a mile run. This is my first run since uh, last Sunday's 10K. Felt pretty good. Um, I can tell that I'm, I just was not fueled up fueled up properly because I was just like it was fine I wasn't in like pain and I wasn't breathing hard or anything but I could just tell I'm just like I am not feeling this run uh, super it felt I felt super drained but um at any rate got her done um I want to run at least once a week and anytime I run I told myself that I have to run at least a mile so today was that day for this week so that's cool if I run more cool if not then I did my duty of what I promised myself a once a week run um anyway hopefully you guys are getting after it um have a good Thursday you ever hear the phrase anything I can do or anything you can do I can do better I can do everything better than you uh well anyway I think that applies to my children because I found the best way to get them to eat their food is if they make it themselves so like like macaroni and cheese we'll say um, when I make it, it's okay. But when they make it, it is phenomenal. And they will empty the fucking pan. Same with, uh, like, Gideon right now. And I'll show you in just a minute. Like, I can suggest clothing all day long. Till I'm blue in the face. And no, no go. But when he makes his own outfit, and by make, I mean, like, I let him take the scissors and he, cut, he has cut holes in it. Because he was playing zombie the other day. Little did I know that this was going to become his favorite outfit that he'd try to wear every single time it's washed. But anyway, so that goes for my kids. Anything I can do, they can do better and they will prove it. So here's his outfit. And he's outside in the cold. What are you wearing today? Your zombie outfit? Yeah. Out in the cold? Does your zombie outfit make you warmer? Better basketball player? Cooler? Something? Well, you're looking kind of spicy. Nice outfit, bro. Time to come inside. It's cold. It's cold. I love you, buddy.
Lindsay, out of the way. Oh, no! Angie is the champion! <laughs> no! 